My name is Tony O'Rourke and I'm the Managing Director of um, FTL Group Technologies Limited. FTL Group are an HB ALM certified partner. We're based in Dublin in Ireland. And our customers typically are those who are implementing enterprise applications and who have a strong focus on quality. So we use the HP application lifecycle management tools to assist those companies to implement test management, functional test automation and performance testing solutions, either on premise or on SaaS. We partnered with NNIT in Denmark. NNIT, with over 2,000 staff, specialise in the delivery of IS application and infrastructure outsourcing solutions to the life sciences sector. FTL Group worked with NNIT to deliver TMLS, which is Test Management for Life Sciences. So one of our customers, uh, UDG Healthcare, operate in the life sciences domain, uh, which is a highly regulated environment. So UDG are currently engaged on a large-scale SAP programme, and they wanted to identify a test management solution, which would help them to optimise quality, reduce costs, and deliver the programme faster. Furthermore, they wanted the solution to be fully compliant with FDA 21 CFR Part 11, which is the Code of Regulations on Electronic Records and Electronic Signatures. And finally, the solution would have to be delivered on SAS. Establishing the test management solution best suited to the environment was the easy piece, because HP ALM Quality Center is by far the market leader in this segment. Quality Center gives full visibility into developer activities and life cycle processes from requirements management to testing and fixing defects. It's also available for deployment on SaaS and on-premise. In this business case, however, it was necessary that the solution would comply with FDA 21 CFR Part 11 regulations, and this involved the addition of a digital signatures module to the process workflows. And finally, the solution would have to be delivered in a GXP-compliant cloud data center environment. So the key benefits to the UDG healthcare business were as follows. The TMLS solution, as it's hosted in a GXP cloud, is already pre-validated. The key benefit here is that 80% of the validation effort normally undertaken by the client has been removed. The next result is that the solution was up and running in two weeks, as opposed to maybe eight to 10 weeks of internal validation effort and its associated costs. In operation mode, the solution was fully supported with a service offering covering customization, admin and end user support. Flexible HP licensing model was used to enable UDG to ramp up and down the users to align with the peaks and troughs of the SAP testing cycles. As TMLS is a fully 21 CFR Part 11 compliant solution, UDG can attribute a 30 minute per defect cost saving over manual paper-based validation processes. Over the lifetime of the SAP project, which is currently at an early stage, this will deliver very significant ROI. Recently, we undertook a customer satisfaction survey the overall scorecard was rated from one to five, five being the best possible result. The results received back from UDG in the survey had a scorecard rating of five, so we must be doing something right.